Hey guys, my name's Logan, or Cream Tag, and today we leave for Mexico. Not in the way that most people would think though, we're not flying down there, we're driving. I've got my, my lunch here, and uh, we're taking the Integra, and I'm gonna be heading over in a bit to go pick up my buddy, and uh, then we're gonna start driving down there. So the first leg of the trip that we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be driving from here, Calgary. We're gonna be driving down to Kelowna, BC. And then down there, we're gonna be staying with family overnight and then uh, the next day. For just for today, it's gonna be a lot of driving and then we're gonna spend some time in the evening in Kelowna. I'm super excited. It's gonna be really fun. I think the first leg to Kelowna is about 500-ish kilometers. It's about six and a half to seven hours, uh, seven, seven and a bit, including stops and whatnot. As you can see, we've started the road trip. We were out here, we were just outside of Banff, Alberta, and we're currently on one of my favorite toge roads. This is my buddy Davis. He's gonna be accompanying us for the road trip. What's up, gang? <laughs> I don't know. He's a little scared of the yeah, camera, but I'll get him, I'll get him, I'll get him different. used to it eventually. Different. He's not used to being in front of the camera, so it is what it is. But yeah, he's gonna be coming with us. He's gonna be getting a bunch of video as well as me. And uh, yeah, we're just here to have some fun, have a good time, and make some good content for you guys. I thought I needed to kind of show this like absolutely gorgeous view. <laughs> yeah, let's, uh, let's head back on the road. from Kelowna and it looks like there was an accident. It doesn't look like it's serious, but this guy's definitely off the road. Davis is still getting used to driving my car. It's different. Oh, dang. All right, we're on the last stretch, finally. We're about half an hour-ish away from the spot we're gonna be staying at in Kelowna. Looking forward to uh, parking the car for the night and uh, calling it a day. We'll probably go out for dinner and whatnot, but other than that, we're just kind of in Kelowna for the night, and then we'll be packing up and heading out, yeah, kind of early in the morning, probably starting tomorrow. If you're watching this, this is gonna be uploaded probably a day or two late, so make sure you keep an eye on my Instagram, at creamtag. Make sure you check that out, and so you can kind of stay up to date with everything that's happening, where I'm gonna be, and all of that. We did it. Did it. 600 kilometers later, we are here and we are in Kelowna, BC. And oh my goodness, the, the view here just, it never gets old. This is my uncle's house and it's absolutely beautiful out here. All right, Davis. Davis drove like the second half of the trip. Yep. What do you think? What do you think of the car? It's fun, it's fun to drive. It's good, I like it. Handles really nicely. Still getting used to driving the the. He drives a manual. Yeah. So Davis Davis drives a manual Audi A4. It's a B5, right? B6. B6. Yeah. He drives a B6, and uh, so this this oh. puppy is a little bit different from what bit. he's used yeah, to. Yeah, a little bit different. But you like it? I like it. That's good because we still got another over 5,000 kilometers to go. Tomorrow will be Seattle. Uh, we're gonna yeah we'll hang out for a bit here. Probably go get some grub and uh, that'll be pretty much it. Day one completed. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. All right, so we're in Kelowna and we're heading out for food now. And I gave the keys to my uncle and he's gonna drive it. So happy. He's uh, he's driven this car before, but it's changed a little bit and it's in better shape than it was the last time he drove it. So uh, yeah. I might give it a bit of gas up Rainbow Hill, if that's all right. Oh, do it, yeah. Because yeah. uh, there's nothing to hit. Feels crisp. 
Did you do anything to the steering other than the new steering wheel? I don't think so. Not that I can think of. I tightened stuff up. I've adjusted the suspension. That might be part of it. Okay. Twist her tail a little bit. Yeah, they can handle these twisties pretty hard. 